In tonight's KX Conversation, helping landowners, big and small, have a one-stop location to get all their questions answered. We're talking about the new centralized information hub, the Dakota Legacy Initiative with Sarah Tunkey. Hello. Thank you glad for joining us. Thank you, I'm glad to be here. All right, so tell us, what is the Dakota Legacy Initiative? Uh, it is a, like you said, a one-stop shop. It is a collaborative uh, conservation program that brings together partners from agriculture, from natural resources, from conservation to provide information to landowners, to producers, to interested parties uh, on conservation topics, technical assistance, cost share that's available, programs and education. So kind of everything there is about conservation, natural resources and agriculture across the state. And why is something like this important for our community? You know, North Dakota is known for its legendary land and water. Uh, it's something that everyone comments on. Our air is so clean, our water is beautiful, our lands are gorgeous. And so we want to include everyone in that conversation. This is a way for them to do it. This is a platform for them to find information, to get connected with the people who are providing those services. And tell us, how can folks access all this information? Uh, we have a website. Uh, DakotaLegacyInitiative.com. We encourage everyone to go there, whether you are a partner who wants to be included or you are a uh, concerned citizen, a producer, a landowner looking for information, go to the website, check it out, look at all the information that's on there. Uh, and there's a contact us uh, button on the website, so feel free to reach out. And tell us something interesting that people will find on the website. Uh, probably one of the greatest things is just the amount of information that's out there. Whether you want to connect to an organization that works with pollinators, uh, or you're interested in water systems for livestock, uh, if you are interested in doing a feedlot, we have information about that. So it's kind of a one-stop shop for everything conservation related. Uh, and there's, there's just so much good information. There's YouTube videos, there's education resources. So uh, there's a lot for everyone. And what do you enjoy most, you know, just when, when talking about the legacy um, initiative? You know, I think it's the passion that all of the partners have for what they do, whether it is strictly related to agriculture producers, whether it is related to conservation and preservation of natural resources, whether it's, you know, reaching out to school age children and talking to them about the land and the water in North Dakota. It's, it's the passion of those people mm -hmm. and it's the passion of the people who are interested in that type of information that I love. And it's just an energy that you can feed off of. Love to hear it, love to hear it. Is there anything else you'd like to add? No, like I said, I would just encourage everyone to please reach out, check out that website. Um, you know, there's a lot of great information. There's a lot of funding that's coming down the, the pipe for conservation and natural resources uh, from the federal government, from the state government. So lots of good resources. So I would just encourage people to go and, and check it out. All right, some great information there. Sarah, thanks so much for joining us. Yeah, thank you.